Hey guys, it's Will for Chucky Vision and we're here this weekend at Supernova 2018 checking out all the cosplay, the games, the films, everything. Let's do it. My name's Grant and I'm the Beast from the live action roleplay movie. My name's Melinda and I'm cosplaying Harley Quinn. And I'm Brooke and I'm Merida from Brave. My name is Tuesday and I'm cosplaying Marvin the Martian um, from the Looney Tunes. Just run into Ace Ventura, how are you man? I am fantastic, thank you for asking. How awesome. I don't reckon I've seen Marvin around for years. Um, you were saying just before that some people were mistaking you for something else. A Power Ranger. <laughs> I don't think Power Rangers have their face open, but I can be a Power Ranger whatever you want. You know. How's your day been so far? Busy, busy? It has been amazing. Great land in this fine city. Just be kind to all the animals. So is this your first cosplay? No, I've cosplayed Harley Quinn before, the classic Harley Quinn, but this is the biggest one that I've ever had um, attention to. Yeah. People really, really love it, which is really great. Uh, for me, it was actually just a running joke with my workmates. Yeah. I didn't have a cosplay planned, and Beauty and the Beast happened to come out at the same time, and they jokingly said, hey, you should go as the Beast. And I went, yeah, why not? Got a few photos and stuff, screenshots online saying that I purchased it when I hadn't. <laughs> and I came across this latex mask and fell in love with it and ended up doing it anyway, so. Yeah. Oh yes, I do many variations of this. I've done wearing a tutu, escaping from the asylum, you know what I mean. But this is my favourite outfit. Uh, well, Merida is my favourite Disney character, so I just had to do it. <laughs> well, I just think she's super cool. She has really awesome taste and she's just so fun and bubbly. Have you done many conventions or is Supernova the one that you do most of the time? Supernova and Comic Con. Um, that's I've been to Adelaide for Supernova. Um, I met Stan Lee, so that's the furthest I've been to travel for a con. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we've got, been going to cons for the last three to four years, so yeah, we're starting to become regulars. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you plan on doing any in the future? Who, or if if you were, who would be the one that you, the ultimate cosplay that you'd like to do, other than Harley? Oh, geez, I don't know. I like doing different versions of Harley, but I really love maybe um, Alice through the Looking Glass. Yeah. What's your next con that you're going to? Uh, the Oz Comic Con in September. And will you be doing anything different or the same? What's the next one? I haven't quite decided. I'm tossing up a few ideas. <laughs> next year I'm hoping to get to San Diego Comic Con with my dad. Uh, nice. I've got a few ideas too, but not nothing solid yet. I would have loved to do uh, a Mr. Magatu from Zealander. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, not, not in the works just yet. <laughs> I think that'd be great. I think you should definitely do that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'd love to do the muscle suit that he does in number two. It'd be hard to do this, it'd be really, really hard, but I'd like to do this yeah, yeah. in an upgraded form, somehow. Yeah, it'd nice. be good. So what's awesome at um, Supernova this year? What should we make sure we check out? I saw a lovely Hulkbuster out there. I hope he doesn't hurt any animals. Made the free parking. I'm gonna say the chocolate strawberries, because that's the only thing I got to see yesterday. The chocolate strawberries. Oh, jeez. Um, oh, there are some Transformers walking around and one of them is covered in sequins. That's probably the best thing I've seen. And the art. In the artwork, the artwork in the artist alley is amazing. So it's, it's great to put them out there. Awesome. Well, have a great weekend and thanks for the chat. You too.